It's important to have a game plan when your cruise stops at ports. Are you going to go on an excursion from your cruise ship or are you going to make your own plans? The good thing about going on the ship's excursion is that the ship can't leave until you arrive back to the ship. If you go to the port on your own, you have to get back before the ship leaves or you're out of luck. The ship will not wait for you. Be sure you know when the ship leaves so that you won't miss it. It's also important to research each port before your cruise to know if you can get off the ship easily or do you need to take transportation to get out of the port. The port terminal normally provides free transportation in that case. If your cruise ship can't dock close to shore, they should provide a tender, which is a small boat that can take you to shore. The reason this can happen is because large cruise ships need deeper water to dock close to shore. I didn't research Mazatlan and Puerto Vallarta port like I should have, um, and I was lucky Mazatlan turned out good, but Puerto Vallarta was a big disappointment. When I got off the ship in Mazatlan, I had no idea that you can't walk on the port. They provide a free tram-like vehicle that takes you out of the port. Then you're on your own. A passenger um, on our cruise ship told us we can walk 30 minutes to the historic center. By following five lines on the ground. Then we bumped into a volunteer guide. That provided a map and told us uh, what we can see per our request, which was the beach. incredible view of Mazatlan from Best Western Hotel rooftop. Port of Virarda didn't turn out good. I thought we could walk around the port to take the, in the great view, but they have a fence around the port. Um, you can walk the busy street, but we chose not to. We did walk to the beach, but a hotel security guard wouldn't allow us to walk on the sidewalk. Um, you could only walk on the sand. If I go to Puerto Vallarta again, I probably will plan on taking an excursion. It's really important to study each port on your cruise beforehand so you don't ruin your trip by not making plans. Yes, I was disappointed about my Puerto Vallarta experience, but it was my fault for not doing my research. I hope this video is helpful when you go on your next cruise. Please do subscribe to my channel. 
Happy cruising!